Ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Huge excitement surrounded the entry into the world of arm wrestling of an athlete from other strength disciplines with genuine pedigree. Enter Larry Wheels. Six foot one inch tall, and he looks like he's been carved from Zeus's tooth. This guy is powerful. There's the arms. He's flexing them already. I mean, the shoulders and the arm, the biceps, the triceps. But is it all show, or is this man a legitimate arm wrestler? We're about to find out, ladies and gentlemen. Larry Wheels. Attitudinally, this guy has shown that he's elite level. He has taken the lumps. He's literally worked as hard as any man could possibly have worked to get here. How much is it worth? We're about to find out. This is exciting. Well, this is a match that back, we've right. all been looking forward to seeing. The referee just going through a few Perfect. final words with both athletes. Look how tall schoolboy is. You He's can see now that schoolboy is a big boy, isn't he? You call that? Well, he's coming. He's the heavier athlete. He's the taller athlete. He's got the leverage. Obviously, I know. Elvis down. Elvis down. Is with Larry. But the experience, open. even though he's young, is still with schoolboy in this match. Without a doubt, loss. And, and Larry is about to feel the Close burn. Thumbs. He's about to get that first hit, and that's the important. Do not move, gentlemen. If Larry Do not can move. Get the on early, Do not cover your knuckles when I close your hands. But he needs close your hands. To he needs to slow Go! it down. Huge <laughs> drive, and schoolboy breaks oh. the hand. No! <laughs> he's laying down a message there. Schoolboy just took the hand and wrist of wheels and sat up. Little dominant. And that's that real Look at, the there. Yeah. Look at the confidence. Ooh. Now, look at the distance between Larry's wrist and the arm of Schoolboy. He kept Larry's arm at bay. He created distance where there is none. He hit into the hand of Larry and then pronated hard. And that creates a gap. And that gap, whilst it was only small, increases his leverage exponentially as the match progresses. And we saw the evidence of that there. It was a crushing win for Schoolboy. 15 seconds, he gentlemen. looked outstanding. Now, Coach Ray is going to be working hard in Larry's corner. But my concern is, Time. with the best intention in the world, it's very difficult to get that, kind, that level of expertise into anyone with practice alone. Well, absolutely. There's, you know, in, in all sports, it's about being match ready. And this, this is, you know, jumping into the deep end for open. This open. Is actually in terms of competitive experience, a novice. We all know how strong he is. You know, we, we've seen the lifts, we've seen the, the, the people he's been against. Close your hands. Do no. not blink, ladies and gentlemen. Big drive! And that's the strap, and it was intentional. So do you think this can help, then? I do think road. it can help a great deal. He's going to be able to access that. But my concern is that it's not going to help a great deal. I, I believe that, if anything, Schoolboy is more experienced in the strap sure. than he is outside of the strap. A lot of people, he's going to blaze through their hand and wrist in his everyday arm wrestling experiences. He is happy in the strap. Larry may not be. Open, gentlemen. Okay, center. Close your thumbs. Close your hands. Now needs to come in to win here. Big drive, but Schoolboy still comfortable. Larry got a little purchase there, and this is better from Larry. Much better. But Schoolboy again able to finish it. I'll tell you what, though. He's got more respect from Schoolboy that time. Yeah, that was far better. Much, much better from Larry. Uh, Schoolboy had a moment, a little moment of concern yeah, there. And he rushed himself. wasn't the same confidence that he had in the first round. Not at all. He drove hard himself and he drove a little too early himself. But fundamentally, you can see the amount of effort having to be put in there by Schoolboy and having to be put in there by Larry. Yeah. And the difference is that Larry is on the absolute red line. He couldn't give any more. Do you think sometimes... It... I guess that's one of the disadvantages of having such huge muscles, is that you burn through that lactic acid quickly, down. or the lactic acid builds up quickly, 
and in terms of endurance, you can lose that power quickly. Yeah. Larry is used to powerlifting. One rep, all out explosive power. He okay. wants to be winning these matches within a couple of seconds. Anything beyond that, Close he's going to drain quickly. Go! Big drive again from Larry, but nothing doing there, and schoolboy completely dominating the hand and wrist. You're, you're moving in front of the replay camera, so they can't see the replay. Look at the hand dominance there, and, and, and what's most important there is how intuitive schoolboy is. Yeah, you can he's, see. You can see that experience. He's not having to think through the movement. It's there for him. He's just moving, reacting, and he's already got control of the match. Strapping. Larry is feeling his way in the dark. This is new territory for him. And it's extremely difficult for him to find a foothold in the match. The strap may assist, but at this point in time, that that experience gap is the difference between these men. Do you think it would be good for someone like Larry, Open. who clearly has great Open potential, up. to enter some competitions and, and get experience against lots of different arm wrestlers? A hundred percent lost. Um, what, what Larry's lacking is not strength, it's not physicality, it's not potential. He's got all of those things. But what he doesn't have is match feeling. He doesn't have familiarity with the position. Yeah. And that's what he's lacking here. And Risk. Schoolboy at this point in time has been able to put a, a couple of serious hits into him, take away all of Larry's power, neutralize it in an instant. And from there, Risk. Larry's panicking and he's unable to recover his position. Close hands. When he does so, it's nothing like what he's experienced One in training. Time. Okay. You feel Close for Larry Wheels. I'd love to see him get something in this match. but. He's facing Open. an extremely tricky opponent. Yeah, an experienced opponent that Close your thumbs. already has the height advantage, the weight advantage. Close your hands. And here's more trading the sport. Oh, 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 fast hit there. Oh, yeah. Big yeah. 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 And unfortunately, Ooh. this is yeah. looking yeah. Ominous, yeah. ominous right now. Yeah, it's very, very difficult to see Larry getting punished up there like that. He's just not able to uh, find a foothold. Um, How many we got? I feel that might be the case for him. He's, it, schoolboy's an extremely okay. tricky individual. I'm not keeping track of that, so... The schoolboy needs to stay focused as well. He doesn't want to lose... You know, he doesn't want to let Larry access that power because, you know, he's such a strong man. So he needs to stay on top of him and hit hard. He's doing exactly what he needs to do. He really is. I mean, let's be honest. Schoolboy came came to Dubai to win an arm wrestling match, and right now yeah, Sergio, so uh, he's, he's doing exactly that. Um, you know, he's you, can't, <laughs> you can't knock the, the man. He's doing exactly what he came to do, and he's doing it well, and he's doing it impressively. And right now, he's dismantling his opponent very early. Most arm wrestlers, when they start the sport, their arm wrestling is done in straight lines. It's done in lifting lines, if you will. The strength which you would believe is all Time, the gentlemen. and it's done in an isolated Man. manner. <laughs> it's not done in a joined way. You're not joining up the muscle groups. It's like almost throwing an arm bunch in boxing rather than twisting your body into the movement, twisting, utilizing the shape. Uh, that's what we're seeing here from Larry. He just isn't able to piece the disparate elements together. Thumbs down. Schoolboy. Close your hands. Cruising at the moment. Go! May slow it down a little bit. Dominates the hand again. It's over. It's another quick win. So, you know what? If I was schoolboy at this stage, I would just jump into a hook with Larry. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, he, he's nothing to lose. Yeah. He's already Test got the match. I'd assist element. the guy. I would assist the guy at this stage, and I'd let Larry get where he's comfortable. Let him have a, a, a little feel, get a little bit of move. The table that favours Larry or Larry's comfortable in. He, he's he's an opposing style. You, you'd like, like to see Larry against, say, like a hook? No. I would. I'd like to see someone who'd come and meet Larry head on, allow Close him to use the power. You know, if you were uh, planning Larry's career Close for me, hands. I would put him against no! someone who's not going to take away his power. A little better, now you go. There we go. He's looking better this time. Yeah. Ale Alex has done this on purpose. He's l allowed Larry to get into the match, and he's letting him pull a little, letting him try and find some position. But Alex is in control. Staying with it now and tightening down, and there's the pin. That was that was better. That's what you expected. That. Oh boy, I hope that he allows Larry to do that. Unfortunately, I think Larry's uh, gone to the bank, and uh, Open, there's not a lot left there now. Open. Schoolboy, there, baby faced assassin. <laughs> Looks like um, he's literally just come back off his paper round. But to be perfectly <laughs> honest, the man is a serial killer. Look at that. He was weighing in close to 280 pounds, I think. It's a big boy. Thumbs down. 
Let's Close see if hand. he does allow Go! Larry to access this one. Oh, he's making taken away the power this time. Larry has nothing in the match there. He just doesn't have there any good at this point. Um, I got a feel for Larry Wales there, Loss. Um, it's hard to watch that. It's tough. But I, I think, like I said to you, Neil, it's important that we all understand that Larry is still very much a novice in this yeah, sport. And it takes <laughs> years, not just for the strength, because arm wrestling is a unique strength. Yeah. As yep, well. I mean, people say it's all just technique. It's really not. The, the strength that some of these armors have, have in certain areas. You know, if this was a powerlifting contest, Larry is going to wipe the floor with schoolboy. Yeah, you'd be looking at the same level of dominance that we've just seen from schoolboy and armor. Different yeah. skill set, <laughs> different muscle groups that are used. What, you, what you've got to know about Larry Wheels, and, and, and I respect uh, 